Hey, Lori Smith here of DavidLoriSmith.com. I had some quick thoughts on uh, the giant Facebook and what that means to social media as far as your home business goes. Stay tuned. you get friends right that they start a new business they're super excited which is fun it's great to be excited and enthusiastic and it, there's a need to tell people what it is you're doing and the change of life that you've had people like lifestyle on Facebook right so lifestyle versus selling on Facebook there's a big difference so you can drip 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 on people the posts you want to put in are actually about lifestyle you know Steve Jobs says this simple can be harder than complex you have to work hard to get your thinking clean to make it simple but it's worth it in the end because once you get there you can move mountains I love this because it he what he's trying to tell you is focus dial it in and keep things simple people like simple and that's another key to building a home business right people like simple they don't like anything hard if they feel like they have to go sell people and you're selling on your Facebook they're not gonna want to join you because they're not gonna want to do what you're doing so to keep duplication in home business and find people on Facebook you really got to help them visualize. You've got to get them excited along with you without selling them. So simplify what you're doing. Focus on what your post is going to be and keep it about lifestyle. Now, it's always good when you start a home business to be excited and start out a comment with, hey, I started a new home business. I'm super excited. I'm going to be able to stay home with my children soon, I hope. And it's a little side business that I've got going. And I just wanted to share that with the world. And you know, and you just don't say, um, so look at this link and see if you want to join me. Right? Um, that's 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 the selling portion. You can be excited, have a new, have a really cool photo of you at one of the events with some friends, just having some fun, that sort of thing. It's celebrating. Celebrate life on Facebook. Don't sell life on Facebook, right? Maybe that makes sense. Gandhi says this in a gentle way, shake the world. Facebook is a way we can stay in touch with the world and even people we don't know, right? Friends who have friends and friends who join and they watch what you're doing. I literally have had people ask me what it is I do. They'll pray, either private message me or they'll make a comment on the post I did and say, hey, I need to know what it is you do. And now I don't go telling what I do on the Facebook feed. That's not what you want to do because you're, you're switching gears now. You're into a sorting mode to see if this person wants to join you in your business. So the most important thing is to do, maybe PM them and say, hey, let's private message and get in touch and I can give you some information. But you don't want to do it on your Facebook feed. You want to celebrate on your Facebook feed. Celebrate new teammates. That's great. I started a new home business. Phenomenal, right? People want to know what you're doing and they want to celebrate you and celebrate with you. So if you keep those simple things in mind, focus and simplicity on your Facebook posts and pictures that you put in, you'll get people asking you what it is you're doing and why you are so excited and they want to join you too. Um, there's some tips here in my in my blog. Please read them and I hope they help. If you find value in them, please share them with people you may think may need um, a little help with the Facebook uh, postings and stuff. If somebody's blasting a bunch of stuff and maybe they need to tone it down a little bit, please share this. And at the very bottom here, I have a link that um, you can actually go and check her out. Her name is Jessica Higdon. She's been great in helping me and my husband in mentoring us in uh, learning Facebook and how to get people asking us um, questions or how to approach somebody on Facebook. So she's got some great tips as well. So um, I hope this helped. Please share or comment below any tips and tricks you have because team means together everyone achieves more. We may not be on the same team or in the same home business, but we are in the same industry. So I hope this blog helped you out a bunch, and I hope to see you on the next video, but ciao for now.